They're bracing for a dangerous second front. But we gain exclusive access to Israel's tense northern frontier. Well, the Israeli army have now sealed off as a security zone some of the areas close to the Lebanese border because of the threat being posed. But they're, they're taking us now um, to the closest period, the closest place they can do that they say is safe to see the lay of the land. And that land is hostile. None of the Israeli soldiers here wanted their faces shown to hide their identities from Hezbollah, the powerful Lebanese militia with a vast arsenal trained on these positions from across the border. We're ready. If they choose to come, they'll make a huge mistake. War with Hezbollah would be brutal, said this senior Israeli commander, who asked not to be identified. But it is now also necessary, he told me. Do you believe there will be a second front open here, or are you hopeful still that Hezbollah will stay out of this war? I hope there will be another front. We need to destroy Hezbollah. You, you hope there will be another front? Yes. You want the war? Yes. Why? What Hamas did in Gaza, it didn't come from nowhere. It came from Hezbollah, it came from Iran. And in order for us to stop what happened from Hamas, we need to stop them also. All right, well, this is as close as the Israeli military say we can go. Just across there, is territory of Lebanon controlled by Hezbollah, the Lebanese uh, militia. And Israeli soldiers in this position in Israel uh, tell us that over the past few days, there have been multiple attempts by Hezbollah fighters to penetrate the fence and to come into Israel, but they've been fought back. If there is going to be a second front in this war in Israel, the likelihood is it's gonna start here. Already there have been exchanges of fire, forcing local Israelis to flee, terrified what happened in Israel's south could happen here too. A terrorist attack at this scale has never yeah. happened and I'm yeah. scared that I live on the border. Yeah. What's to stop them from doing it here? And I want to be strong and I want to come back and live here, but, but I need to think about my kids first. Back from the border, Israel is bolstering its forces with some of the 360,000 troops mobilized after the Hamas attacks last week. If war in the north is coming, Israel seems ready, even bristling to fight. Matthew Chance, CNN, Northern Israel.